Hi guys, today I'm going to give my thoughts on another film that Ringo Starr was in and this time I'm going to be talking about 200 Motels. I have already done a video on his first two films, um, Candy and The Magic Christian, if you want to check that one out. 200 Motels is a 1971 musical film written and directed by Frank Zappa and Tony Palmer and featuring music by Zappa. A soundtrack album was also released in the same year and there was also a box set that was released celebrating the 50th anniversary which I think looks really good. If I was a fan of Zappa I would definitely want to get this. The film shows quite crazy footage of the Mothers of Invention and when I first saw the film I did see it purely because I was a fan of Ringo Starr and he plays as Larry the Dwarf and he's dressed as Frank Zappa throughout the film, all in purple with big hair. I think Ringo looks great in this film and I think he really does look like Zappa. I remember when I watched it for the first time and, and I was looking out for Ringo in the film, I kept getting him confused with Zappa all the time. They do look really similar. But when I first saw the film, I will be honest, I didn't know who Zappa was, I didn't know who the Mothers of Invention were, and so even now I feel like I can't say a lot about the film because I still don't really know much about them. I know for people who know and appreciate who are fans of the Mothers of Invention, absolutely loved this film and found it a real masterpiece as the film provides an extension of concerts and recordings. But for me personally and being honest I was confused by a lot of it when I first saw it but that was because I didn't know anything about the band. But that's not to say I didn't enjoy the film, I really did enjoy watching it. I really liked seeing the slightly weird craziness of the scenes and the special effects of the time and I really enjoyed the music I was hearing for the first time and after the film I did want to know more about Zappa because I did enjoy the music I was hearing. Overall for me I did find the film strangely interesting and I can see why hardcore fans would really love this film. For me I suppose it's like seeing the Magical Mystery Tour as a film. A lot of people at the time who probably weren't huge Beatle fans saw the film and thought what is this and was confused by it all. As a Beatle fan I absolutely love the Magical Christian. Um, the Magical Mystery Tour film. One of the reasons why I love it so much is because all the music that's in it from the Beatles and just seeing anything with the Beatles in I find just so enjoyable. And any film with a Beatle in I will watch, which is why I first watched this film because Ringo Starr is in it. And I have got here in an article written by Tony Sokol um, what Ringo said about first getting into the film. It says that Ringo said a call came from the Apple office that Frank Zappa had this idea and he wanted to present it to me. I thought oh great because I'd heard Frank's music. In a very musical way it was very wacky actually. So I invited Frank to my house. He laid this huge score out and said I've got an idea to make this movie and here's the score. I said why are you showing me the score? I can't read music because of that I will do the movie. Ringo goes on to say that it wasn't just any part, he told me he wanted me to play him because he just wanted to be a musician in it. Ringo also said that it was strange for Ringo playing Frank. It was a nice premise and I got to hang out with other musicians which is always a good deal. While filming in 200 Motels Ringo went along with one of his best friends who was the drummer for The Who, Keith Moon, who also has a role in the film. I think the film is definitely worth seeing if you're a fan of Zappa or Ringo Starr or just like experimental musical films or innovative cinema. And I just wanted to show you the DVD I have of 200 Motels. First of all, I just love this cover. It looks amazing. You can see Ringo there at the front looking very much like Zappa. Yeah, I just think this is an amazing cover. And here's the back. Got Ringo, is that Ringo? See, I thought that was Ringo just then. It's this one, this one here. We've got Ringo at the back. 
and then inside I've just got the CD. I don't know if this was meant to come with a booklet. I'm not sure if I got this film second hand or not. I can't remember now, but it's, if I did, it's in really good condition. Thank you very much for watching this video. Please let me know your thoughts on the film and if you're a fan of Zappa because I would love to hear more about him and um, the mothers as well. And uh, yeah, thank you very much for watching this video. I really hope you enjoyed it. Please subscribe if you want to see more from me and I will see you in my next video. Bye.